Okay, good afternoon, it's Tony Kelly here from the Fitness Clinic. Today what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk about pull-ups. Pull-ups or chins, depending on where you come from and what you want to call them. Now, chins, pull-ups are probably one of the best exercises you can do for the upper body. So if I was to choose four exercises, freestanding exercise that I do, that I give to a person that didn't have any equipment in the middle of a desert or whatever, well, in the middle of a desert it would be hard to find a pull-up bar, I know, but it would be pull-ups, push-ups, so pull-ups for all the back, end, back front of the arms, push-ups for all the chest, so opposing muscle groups, squats, and lunges, so there are the four. So we've covered the other three, we've done the push-ups, we've done the, the squats, and um, so pull-ups, we're going to cover now, we've done the push-ups, we've done the lunges, and we've done the squats. All right, so there's, ideally you need a piece of equipment to be able to do pull-ups, but there are ways to kind of get around it. So I'm going to explain the different kind of pull-ups that you can do, and you can go into most of the big stores, you can go into your Elbridge, you can go into your Argos, um, Champions and all the rest of them, and you can buy pull-up bars that you can put in your door, ideally the ones that hook over the frame. So the first one is, the wider the grip, the more you're going to work this area here of the lats. So, nice and wide, from here, bend the knees if you want to, all the way up, slowly down. So the wider, and then we're going to come in, the easiest one is a reverse grip. Okay, so in this fashion here, reverse grip, we're going to pull up, slowly down. And that gets more at the bicep, so if you're into kind of building big biceps, you should be doing lots and lots of pull-ups because it helps to bend the arms. Okay, now a way to help you to do pull-ups if you find that difficult because it can be a very, very difficult exercise is to use something to jump up with. So if you want to put a platform or chair underneath and what you do is you jump up, lower yourself down. Okay, down to the ground, jump up, lower yourself down. Okay, so there are the different types of push-up, and again, keep the consistency there, keep it up, up, slowly down, fantastic for all the lat front here, and also for the whole core area, because you're pulling yourself in tight, this is working tremendously. So I'm now going to go on and move on to another way that you can do pull-ups, if you don't have the height or you can't do them. 